Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Lightcraft. Today we're going to be working on the base, and you might remember that we worked on the base um, a lot. And so, we um, are going to go do a little more right now. So let's go work on the base um, right at, in front of us. Uh, okay, up there, basically. So up there, I'm going to be working on a mob farm. That's what I'm going to be making up there, and it's going to be really cool, I think. We're gonna make a mob farm, and the mobs are going to fall into the, uh, the, like, hole there, and go down to the filter system, which I've already made. So, let's go and do that right now. And it is done! It is right here. It's actually looking really good. It's, um, so I may have gone a little overboard at the front, but, um, I, I left it playing on the side, so that's what the original design was, but then I decided to go a little bonkers on the front. And inside... The bombs fall down in there, and then they go into a lava pit, which is right there. And they all fall down, like that creeper right there. And they all die in that lava. They're hoppers that will catch all the mob drops. And if they are actually right in this thing, right there. You can see the white thing. But the thing is, this is my gladiator's arena that I made. Um, If you watched season two of Lightcraft, uh, I made a uh, gladiators arena, and this is the version 2.0 uh, I made this season. I actually played with it with friends, but then the recording footage I had with the friends, um, Blue Draws, Gavin, 27, and I'm pretty sure we had Liberty, too. So yeah, um, we had a bunch of people playing, and it was very sad because the video file got corrupted, so... It was like, uh, uh, it was so fun though. Like, <laughs> I know, okay. So, they are so chaotic whenever they're fighting. Um, and basically, oh no, that's not the messy chest. That's not the messy chest. I organized, oh yeah. See, this is what they did afterwards. <laughs> they didn't clean up anything. See, this was, um, the thing before. And, like, you can kind of see the kits, but, yeah. And I had to work for all of these, like, the tridents are so hard to get. And if you don't believe me, go try and get some yourself. If you don't have a farm for them, it's an absolute pain. I do have a farm for, um, Drowned, and I also have an Elder Guardian farm. Uh, I mean, a Guardian farm. Uh, but the, the Drowned farm, that I got the, uh, the, these lanterns from the Guardian farm. But the, um, Drowned farm is so hard to make. I, like, quadrupled the size of it this episode, just, just for those. Like, it's that big now. Like, yeah. So, <laughs> I hope you did like this. I think uh, I really like it. But the, 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 um, Gladiators Arena literally took me so long. You wouldn't believe. Oh, yeah, that's, that's Gavin's head right here. He changed his skin again. And so now I might have to change, uh, some things on some of my video thumbnails, but I don't think I'm going to, but this is his head, it's, uh, very, I don't know, it, it works for him, I think, uh, I don't think, I think he has bunny ears, I'm not sure, but I think he has bunny ears, Gavin, if you're watching this, comment down below and tell me if you have bunny ears or not, because this is very weird, and in my hot bar, if you saw them, the perhaps you perish parcels, yeah, I have these, and I'm going to be selling them here, um, because this one was blown up, I don't think I've told you guys this, but basically there is some lore on the, the Lightcraft server. A little bit. A very small amount, but we don't really feature it in videos. It's just us playing around with each other. And Snagon is our lore director, and um, he um, did this for the lore. And he didn't tell me, so uh, whenever I got on, I was a little bit angry. Um, but then he told me that it was for lore, and I was like, yeah, I did promote him to the lore boss. So, I mean, I can't really get mad. So, <laughs> yeah, basically, all our diamonds and stuff were all lost here. It was very, very sad. 120 diamonds each box. Thanks for your money. Get it. And there are four in there right now, but I'm working on some more, uh, um, this episode. But, um, these, this, um, was also kind of destroyed. Um, as you can see, and Blue Jaws, since he has insurer care for his, um, the shops here, and so, he's been fixing this. And this is all he's done so far. <laughs> so basically, he has insurer care for the shopping district, since he does own it. 
So basically you can pay extra diamonds for a chair care and basically that's what he's doing right now. I don't know why he uses random color concrete and just yeah, this is this is blue draws for you. So the other day, um the the blue thought that um the uh, snack on was griefing my base cuz he did see the giant mess over there and I, I I'm I'm glad that he tried to get um snack on back for me. But uh, basically, this entire place was covered in dirt, and you can see some remnants of it, but you- so the thing is, being an admin is not an easy task. So when I got back onto the server, I was like, who did this? What- and then I saw that- then everyone DM'd me and told them that, that it was Snackon's fault, and then they said it was Blue's fault, and I was like, WHOSE FAULT IS IT?! WHO DID THIS?! And then I had to clean it all up and it's, um, very sad. I don't know if I've shown this in the videos yet, but this is the courthouse. We had it for 27Y because he had a bunch of briefings on the server and he wouldn't stop. So, we decided to hold a, um, court case for him and we never did do that court case. So, the courthouse is just sitting here, unused for a very long time. So basically, there is a little bit of lore I can show you because it's kind of funny. The Obsidian Grip, it, it involves me kind of, I think. Uh, I think they uh, added me into it. And um, so yeah, 27Y says I'm in it. But um, basically, this is part of the Obsidian Grip. Now, the Obsidian Grip basically is trying to steal everybody's houses and destroy everything. Um, so, yeah, basically, I decided that since I'm part of the Obsidian Grip, I decided to do, I decided to do this. Now, this is a very, um, interesting prank because there's an Elder Guardian in there. No oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. Okay, now I have the effect. So, basically, I put an Elder Guardian in there, and the Obsidian Grip is there. So, now, it takes him forever to break the obsidian. It, it's amazing. It's the best prank ever. I did it everywhere at his base. It's very cool. <laughs> I don't know if uh, Wild has done anything on her base. So, like, since the last time she got on, it's really cool. Like, I don't know how long it took her to do this, but yeah, it, it's actually looking pretty nice. And I think she's adding the trees in on purpose, or she just wants Podzel. If she wants Podzel, I'm just gonna leave a shulker box with Podzel at her door. And you may have noticed I had dragon e dragon heads in my inventory. I do. I have both kinds, and they are both really cool. Like, I think that this kind is just a small version of this, but without the beak. Is it a beak? It looks like a beak. Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry if it isn't a beak, and I thought it was. Okay, maybe some of you guys are um. Minecraft nerds. I'm not a Minecraft nerd, okay? I don't know these things. We did finish the diamond wall in my room, too. So, yeah, this is really nice. Can't let people get my head. And if you notice, I do have a good a new skin. It's actually really nice. I worked on it myself. I didn't get someone to make it for me, like my sister or my brother or my other friend who makes skins. So, yeah, yeah I just made it myself. And it's uh, I don't know what you guys think of it, so if you like it, Drop a like, maybe? Uh, that would be really nice. And I think somebody kind of destroyed our headroom, because this is what it is now. Alright, guys. Now. No, 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 no. This is not the end of the video, where I just walk off the edge of my base. No. This is where I tell you about a little thing I might do. It depends on you guys, actually. If you- if this video gets 15 likes, I will make the Season 2 Mega Base. Like, I will continue making it. I'll show you a little picture of it right there, and if you guys do like it, um, if you want, you guys want me to continue making it and you like the base, drop a like on this video. This video gets 15 likes. I'm making it, okay? And if this video gets me to have three more subscribers, just three, that's not that many subscribers, I will make it into a gigabase. And that's going to be hard, okay? <laughs> so, yeah. Also, I'm not going to be doing this, like, if it's, like, three months it takes. Like, I'm talking about, like, one month. 
from this video coming out. Also, only a small percentage of my viewers, only 15% of my viewers are actually subscribed. Uh, YouTube please, said so. Please. And subscribe. I can shift in the air? Who knew this? Who without this knowledge from me? This is so weird. In a while of looking around my base and uh, grinding later, I finally found some podzol. I worked on it and worked on it, and now I have two shulkers, a podzol to give to Wild. Hi, Wilder. It's Gid. I brought you some podzol because I saw you need it. And we've got two shulkers, a podzol. Ooh, she has a lot of cobble. I don't think we need to give her any more. But yeah, this is her base. It actually looks really nice like it's insane also i noticed that um blue draws made a custom prank shop and i'm going to leave my own on wild i brought an obsidian piece of uh i brought obsidian wildly juniper get bid custom and i paid my diamonds over here obsidian grip at her base that was the idea and uh yeah so dash get bid it was from me. So yeah, that's uh let's hope he does that soon, cause that's gonna be really funny. You know, if I were wild, I would just say, you win some, you lose some, you know, cause she got the she got the puzzle, but she also like uh, is gonna have to handle a lot of obsidian at her base, so that might be something. Also I didn't ne I never noticed that this nether portal was here actually. It's very strange. I've been, uh, this season has been going around on for like how many months? Um, and it's, like, still here, and, um, there's a slab in there. That's interesting. And I haven't found it. So, like, that's, that's very weird. Now, this is the part of the video where I walk off the side of my base and say it's the end of the episode. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you did enjoy it, please like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. It helps me out a ton. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode. This is my life now. Just buying Sheikrin heads. Until the episode is done. You might be able to hear my keys clipping. Subscribe.